Hi guys, what's up? It's Lindsay and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I thought I would bring you along with me while I clean up my apartment that has been in a state of disarray since this last month of my life was extremely difficult, um, which we can get into later, but I have really just neglected my house chores, I have not vacuumed, I really need to do my laundry, I have no socks left. So today is that day, and I personally find watching people clean just so therapeutic. It inspires me to clean. You can even put this vlog on if you need to clean your room or your apartment, and hopefully it can give you some inspiration to do the same, because I know I'm so affected by my environment, and when my place is really cluttered or not clean, it affects my mental health as well, but you know, this month I just really haven't had the capacity to even take care of my space but I'm feeling a bit better and I know that this will really just feel so great without further ado we are gonna get started on cleaning the first thing I'm gonna do is probably the dishes um, because I just had breakfast I also had my dishes from dinner last night and um, so that needs to be handled I am just so prone to leaving cups and mugs all over the house, so I'm gonna collect all of those and wash them, set them out to dry since I don't have a dishwasher. Then I wanted to strip the couch and wash my couch covers. It's so much easier to do this when my dog is at home and she's at my parents this weekend, but it's really great if you have allergies or a dog to try and do this frequently. So I really like to. It makes the couch look so much puffier and it also obviously helps a lot with allergies or if you have a dog for just keeping things clean and nice. So I'm gonna do a load of these along with some of my sheets. So I'm gonna go strip my bed as well. I really tried to have my laundry loads be as full and water efficient as possible, also because I share a laundry room with my neighbors, and so I try not to just, you know, be using the laundry all day, and I do have to pay for it. Here's my container of quarters, so I really try and savor them. So my first load is going to be the couch covers as well as some sheets from my bed. Our laundry room is in a basement, so it's not the most aesthetically pleasing, but it gets the job done. I just try and do all of my laundry in the early morning and before it gets dark because I really don't like being down here in the evening. We are making some great progress. I am now going to vacuum. This is my vacuum, it's from Shark and it has a really long cord, so I actually don't really have to unplug it and I can vacuum the entire living room, most of the kitchen in my bedroom. So I am going to then like deeper clean vacuum both spaces, but for the most part, it's okay. So I am gonna put my AirPods in and try and do this in under 45 minutes so that my laundry can then be turned over. Taking a moment to sit down and breathe after all of this running around I've been doing. It feels really great to look around and just enjoy my clean apartment. I just made a quick lunch of some breakfast tacos and hung up some of my wet laundry that I don't want to put in the dryer. I really need a drying rack, but for now, I just kind of hang things on my patio. Today's video is also sponsored by BetterHelp. If you're new here, I am a huge advocate for therapy as well as taking care of your mental health. That is pretty much what this video is entirely about. BetterHelp will assess your needs and pair you with a licensed professional therapist that you can start communicating with in under 48 hours. It is not a crisis line. It is not self-help. BetterHelp is professional counseling done securely online. The service is available for clients worldwide and they have over 15,000 counselors in their network. So there's a really broad range of expertise and specialties that might not be locally available in your area otherwise. 
Because it's online, you can log in at any time to send messages to your counselor to receive timely and thoughtful responses, as well as schedule weekly video or phone sessions. It's easy to switch counselors if you need to as well. If you don't automatically click with your first one, they understand the value of a great therapeutic match and are there to help you find it. And what I think is the best about BetterHelp is that it is more affordable than traditional therapy and financial aid is available. If you're interested, visit betterhelp.com slash lindsayrem. That's better H-E-L-P for 10% off your first month at BetterHelp and join the over 1 million people taking charge of their mental health with an experienced professional. Could not have had a more fitting sponsor for today because this month has just really been testing me and I have appreciated having my therapist in my life more than ever. It's really great to have someone to talk to regardless, but when things do kind of hit the fan and you are going through things that are really difficult or traumatic, it is amazing having that person be there and be that stability for you that you can talk to every single week their willingness to listen to you and just be there for you and hold that space feels just so out of this world good when you really really need it and this month has just been really rough from the car accident to some things in my personal life i have just been struggling it's been really nice to take a break today. And although I'm creating content, I also just cleaned my whole apartment and I feel so much clearer headed because it's clean in here. And yeah, I also have been known to cope with buying things and I've been trying to work on that as well. So like today I haven't spent any money and I don't plan to. In the month of January, I want to do a no buy where I buy nothing new. And um, if you guys want to join me on that, feel free to. I know it's already November, um, so we have like some months until then, but that's something that I'm going to be doing. And just one of, I guess, like one of my New Year's resolutions um, is to be a little bit less materialistic. I just lost my train of thought because my um, alarm went off for my laundry. So I'm going to run downstairs and get that going in the dryer so that it'll be done before the sun sets because the sun is setting so early these days and then we'll put the cushions back on the couch because <laughs> i haven't done that yet I just folded all of my towels. Some of these are my bath towels, but kitchen towels I keep in this drawer. And I learned this from my mom. It makes them so easy to grab. You just have them all stacked sideways. Can you see that? It's so pleasing to me. It is 5 p.m. now and I'm bringing out the Dutch oven because I am gonna make some soup. I have quite a bit of back pain right now, so I'm hoping I can just throw everything in the pot and then go lay down on the couch with my heating pad. So here we go. <laughs> I have some little red potatoes, some veggie broth. I have frozen carrot, onion, and celery, or no, I have frozen celery and onion. I need to chop the carrot. That's the only thing that I need to chop. And then earlier today, I actually made a pot of wild rice. Um, it's on like the keep warm setting. So I'm gonna do like veggies, potatoes, wild rice. I have some thyme, just like really simple and um, easy.
and if I end up not having an outro for this video, which I tend to do, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed spending the day with me. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and don't forget to check out BetterHelp. You can get 10% off your first month by going to betterhelp.com slash Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you all later.